Hello friends, we back for another Game of Thrones reaction. Today we're checking out Season 3, Episode 3. Now in the last episode, we got a lot of moving parts. Bran meeting up with the Reeds, right? Jojen and Mira, was it? We got um, Theon being captured. I'm guessing this is by, you know, the Northmen. Which is, I was saying in the in the previous video, very surprising because it seems like the Ironborns escaped, but they left Theon there for some reason. That's going to be weird. So it doesn't look like Theon is going to be living or, you know, surviving in the show for much longer. Uh, we got a little Jon Snow here and there. We got... We got a little, you know, love scene or, you know, like a little uh, flirting between Marjorie and Joffrey. Uh, that's pretty much the episode. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We also got Arya meeting up with the Brotherhood uh, without banners. And they captured the Hound. Because the Hound escaped King's Landing, right? He's kind of a rogue knight uh, these days. So yeah, without further ado, let's check out the next episode. Mm hmm Oh man. <laughs> Let me what what is this? Let me show you how it's supposed to be done. <laughs> wow. Damn, that was sick. So that's like family of cat, I guess. Which may have some bearing upon you. Damn milk. <laughs> call him nephew. He's your king. Rob knows I meant him no disrespect. You're lucky. I'm not your king. <laughs> you wave your blunders around like a victory flag. Oh my god, this guy is ruthless. He's carrying back to Castle Rock with his tail between his legs. I seized an opportunity. What value was the mill? The mountain was garrisoned across the river from it. Is he there now? Of course not. We took the fight to him. He could not withstand us. I wanted to draw the mountain into the west, which he would have done because he is a mad dog without a strategic thought in his head. I could have that head on a spike by now. Oh, wow. Instead, I have a mill. <laughs> Dude, this show is low key comedy. Willem Lannister. How many men did you lose? 208. But for every man we lost, the Lannisters. We lost need him. our men more than Tywin needs his. Yep. Didn't know you would have. Right here today at this gathering, if you had been patient. We seem to be running short of patience here. Yeah. You know who isn't? Tywin Lannister. Damn, this show! Amazing. What the? <laughs> what an entrance. 20,000 unwashed northerners have known about his escape for weeks. Collectively, you control more spies and informants than the rest of the world combined. Wow. You mean to tell me that none of you has any notion of where he is. We are trying, my lord. Try harder. I like the try harder. What do we have then? Rob Stark and most of his banner men are in River Run for the funeral of his grandfather, Lord Hostetali. The Lord of Harren Hall will make a worthy suitor for the Widow Arryn. For which I am extremely grateful to you, my hmm. lord. Lady Widow Arryn, Arryn. Have known each other since we were children. She has always been positively predisposed toward me. A successful courtship would make Lord Baelish act in the Lord of the Vale. Lord of the Vale? Ooh! You'll leave for the Ooh. So they're matching up 
Baelish with the veil. But that's Cat's sister. How does that work? Here as soon as possible and bring Lighter Aaron into the fold. Which is why I'm naming you new Master of Coin. Master, Master of, of Coin, coin Tyrion. Position that best suits your talents. Errol, black and brown and covered with hair. He smelled that girl in the summer air. The bear, the bear, and the maiden fair. The bear, the bear, and the maiden fair. Help you, please. Damn, they got captured, huh? never would have taken it. You were armed. Bro. Leave it in the comments if you think um, Rob is going to execute Brienne. Because she should have known as well, right? I've been sitting in a muddy pen, wrapped in chains for the past year. Damn, he was a prisoner for a year? If you fight them, they will kill you. Do you understand? I'm the prisoner of value, not you. Yep. Let them have what they want. What does it matter? What does it matter? Close your eyes. Pretend they're Renly. <laughs> if you were a woman, you wouldn't resist. You'd let them do what they wanted. If I was a woman, I'd make them kill me. I'm not thank the gods. He takes his prisoner, and now he's our friend. You're not our prisoner, little lady. Who am I? Our guest. I always put any chains on you. So I can walk away, then? These woods aren't safe for Ned Stark's daughter. Mm -hmm. You're lucky we found you. You think you're good with that bow? You little twat. Better than anyone mm -hmm. you've ever met. Coward's weapon. Looks like every other shit in on the road. Now, apologies, but you're one ugly fucker. I baked some brown bread for the innkeep, and she said she never had better. So I thought she's keeping me as a payment for all the free meals she's given him. Anyway, it's not me the Brotherhood wants. My brother ain't no king. Oh. I'm not Stark of Winterhell. Winterfell. You sure? You sure? Yeah, she she lived there. <laughs> oh. She would know. I made you something. Oh. What is it? It's a wolf. Okay. Be safe. Okay, so he's gonna be a baker. I wonder if he's gonna die. <laughs> Is it true what they say about him? I don't know. What do they say about him? That they can turn into a wolf at night. Damn, Rob the wolf. <laughs> and he eats the flesh of his enemies. True. You're a Lannister, aren't you? Martin Lannister. Martin Lannister. Nothing to fear. My husband doesn't eat children. Yeah. Okay, we're at the wall. Always the artists. Ah. Wait. Have we seen that before? No men. I think we saw something in season one like that. We're finally going to war. Old friend. Hide near Castle Black. When I give the signal, hit them in the night. Oh, we're attacking Castle Black. That's gonna be awkward for John. But I guess John's gonna betray them, right? If you do your job. He has to. I always see a signal. Send your eagle above the wall every night. When it's time, I'm going to light the biggest fire the North has ever seen. Damn! What have we here? Frozen crows. And who's this guy? Way. Smaller flock than he went north. Oh, Craster. We can talk inside. Oh. Can we? I mean, they can kill you. <laughs> Easily. You should all be kissing my feet for letting you in. I'd have turned you all away if I wasn't a godly man. You are a godly man. I am. I got no fear of what's out there. When the white cold comes, your swords and cloaks and bloody fires won't help you. The only ones left will be those who are right with the gods. 
That's how right there gave birth to a litter of eight. Barely a grunt. But she's almost as fat as this one here. <laughs> Why don't you dine on him? Carve off what you need as you go. Well, look at him. He's a walking feast. Damn. He wants some Sammy. <laughs> that is awkward. Oh, this is uh, Theon. Keep quiet. Ouch. Dude, can you walk? I don't think I could walk with that. Like, not immediately, for sure. It's nice to see some Stannis. I want Joffrey dead. I want Rob Stark dead. Damn. Your fires burn low, my king. Oh. There is another way, a better way. You told me your magic requires a king's blood. Yes. I'm the one true king. You mm -hmm. are. But there are others with your blood in their veins. Oh. You will sit on the Other Baratheons? Be sacrifices. A Lord of Light demands it. Mm hmm. Here. For any slave who contemplates doing whatever these slaves do. Give me your water. Tell me, see. This man has been sentenced to death. Damn, they got crucified, man. This is a little too much. Leave this place, Your Grace. Leave tonight, I beg you. What is she to do for soldiers? We can find Celsos in Pentos and Mir. Pentos and Mir? We already submerged them. But the Unsullied are not men. They do not rape. They do not put cities to the sword unless they're ordered to do so. Mm. If you buy them, the only men they'll kill are those you want dead. Do you disagree, Sir Barristan? When your brother Rhaegar led his army into Battle of the Trident, Men died for him because they believed in him, because they loved him, not because they'd been bought in a slaver's auction. Mmm. Loyalty or order, I guess. Did this man's ears mishear your grace? They did not. I want to buy them all. Ebas pon simi ho uni. No kotas pon erajo. <laughs> this guy. There are 8,000 unsullied in Astapor. Is this what you mean by all? Yes, 8,000. And the ones still in training as well. Wow. I have dragons. I'll give you one. Whoa. You will win the throne with dragons, not slaves, Your Grace. I mean, you can, you can, you can do it with two, I guess. You don't need three, but you do need men, I guess. Three, dragon. One, two, one. One, yeah. You're only getting one man. Like dragons are, mm, you know. I'll take you as well. Now. You be Master Krasny's gift to me. Token of a bargain well struck. Pindasko jiun te bila vanaruti. Pindasko gome la kizisir. Khaleesi, a dragon is worth more than any army. Egan Targaryen proved that. You're both here to advise me. 
I value your advice, but if you ever question me in front of strangers again, you'll be advising someone else. Damn! Damn. I will say... It goes back to what I was saying about Daenerys being very lucky. She has all this help, right? Like, these guys don't owe her shit, right? They could just fuck off and then she's free to make all the the wrong decisions that she, you know she's going to make, right? The, the encounter with the 13 of Kath proved that she got them killed, essentially. So, I don't know. That's all of them, my lord. Thank you, my dear. Pod. Pod. Take them outside. I'll be there mm -hmm. in a moment. Yes, Lord. I owe you a significant debt. Our red-headed friend. <laughs> you secured her release when the Queen detained her. Mm. But, of course, a simple misunderstanding. Apparently, her grace believed that you two had some sort of special relationship. Yep. We don't. I did fuck her once. I know. But we don't. I know. But we don't. <laughs> How would the queen get that idea? Why don't you ask her? Secret history of the Seven Kingdoms is written in these pages. Mm. Unless Lord Twatbeard made up a bunch of numbers to hide what he's really up to. Unless he made it all up, yes. Podrick, do you keep up? Yes, look. Podrick? Yes, Lord. After a long consultation with my colleague, Sir Bron, I finally found a suitable reward for the services you've provided over and above what might be considered reasonable. Tell me, Pod. Have you ever been with a woman? No, oh, my lord. Wonderful. Ridiculous face, wouldn't you? Oh! Say? He's getting some action! As it happens, Murray. Quite the spear oh man, he's getting he's getting a threesome. As the battle raged all around me. He's handsome. The crown owes millions to my father. Seeing as it's his grandson's ass on the throne, I imagine he'll forgive that debt. Forgive a debt, my father. For a man of the world, you're strangely naive. I've never borrowed money before. I'm not clear on the rules. Well. The basic principle is, I lend you money, and after an agreed upon period of time, you return it with interest. And what if I don't? We owe them tens of millions. If we fail to repay these loans, the bank will fund our enemies. Oh. One way or another, they always get their gold back. Interesting. Ah, the return of the conquering hero. Does he have a little jaunt in his step? The lad's practically skipping. <laughs> you were gone a long time. I trust you got your money's worth, or should I say my money's worth? I wouldn't take it, my lord. Maybe they're trying to curry some favor with the new master of coin. Have you ever known a whore to turn down gold? They were happy enough to take it when I gave it to them. What did you tell them? I didn't tell them anything. What did you do to them? Lots of things. And they seem to like these things? <laughs> yes, my lord. Sit down, Podrick. <clears throat> Damn, he screwed the girl so good. They they didn't want money. Going to need details. Yeah. <laughs> details. Yeah, yeah. Tell us, tell us the secrets <laughs> for free sex. Oh. Oh boy. They caught up fast. Interesting. Oh, knocked out. 
Yeah. So they're gonna take him back. Ah, uh, unfortunate for Theon. You know how we deal with runaways here, dear? Oh. Take off his pants. What? No way. I'm gonna fuck you into the dirt. No, please. No, no, no. 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 Oh. What the hell? Yo, who is this guy? I thought he was with them, with the Starks. You're a long way from home. Winter is coming. Damn. He saved the uh, Theon twice. My lord, I am Brienne of Tarth. Lady Catelyn Stark commanded me to deliver Sir Jamie to King's Landing. Catelyn Stark's a treasonous cat. Yep. All this work to take the Kingslayer alive. Nobody said shit about you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yep. Take her over there where it's dark. Like a little privacy. She's Brienne of Tarth. Her father's Lord Selwyn of Tarth. Heard of Tarth? They call it the Sapphire Isle. You know why? Every sapphire in Westeros was mined on Tarth. Oh. Sapphires are gemstones, the blue ones. I know what they are. They're rich, essentially. Lord Selwyn would pay his daughter's weight in sapphires if she's returned to him. The North can't win this war. Hmm. You're a smart man, you understand that. We have the numbers, we have the gold. Aye. You have both. Fighting bravely for a losing cause is admirable fighting for a winning cause is far more rewarding can't deny that <sighs> do argue with that yep bring the bird over here this will do nice ah! carving knife will this work as a table my lord oh yes yes this will do nice ah! I'm oh! You think you're the smartest <coughs> man there is? And everyone alive has to bow and scrape and lick your boots. Oh! Oh my god! They cut his hand! Is that it? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's it. Wow! Jamie without his hand! Damn! Imagine if they cut the other hand, right? Like, he, he, he really can't fight now. But damn, and that was, I guess he's right-handed, right? Right hand, yeah. That is, that is sick. Okay, so, plot-wise, Arya is traveling with a brotherhood without banners. Uh, We got some slice of life with the uh, Tyrion and the uh, Tyrion Podrick and ah what's his name again Bronn 
uh, they're they're trying to find out like how to get money for like the the wedding, right? We see we see Jon Snow. Uh, they say something about uh, preparing for war with Castle Black. Um, and then we continue like the journey of uh, Bran with the kids. Also, Daenerys offering one of her dragons for the army. I forgot what they call the army, but it, it is what it is. So yeah, a lot of moving parts, a lot of developments. <sighs> Definitely, they save the shocker for the end. Jamie losing his uh, his hand, and that's probably his good hand. I would assume, you know people tend to be more right-handed than left so that's probably it uh so yeah if you guys like the content like comment subscribe if you want to support your boy even more links to patreon down in the description and put some besos in the in the comments guys like your boy needs his you know what i mean and i'll see you guys on the next one cheers